getting any better? <laughs> the weekend, Rich. We've got to wait until the weekend. But uh, we have got some rain today. If you're off on your doggy walk, I'd go now because it's working its way in at the moment across the west of the country. And if you were up very early this morning, it was a little bit misty and a bit foggy. And Sky Girl, one of our weather watchers, has captured that quite nicely first thing this morning. Now, we have got low pressure. We've also got a weather front, well, a couple of weather fronts around through this afternoon and into the evening. The first one is a warm front that's bringing some heavy bursts of rain at times through this afternoon across the East Midlands. Could also turn a little bit thundery as well, so the potential for some heavy sort of uh, thundery showers mixed in with that and some lightning too. So it is going to be quite a wet end to today. With the temperatures, they've come down a little bit from Sunday when it was very humid, but still 19 Celsius this afternoon. And then through the evening and overnight, one area of rain clears. It's replaced by the second coming in. This is a cold front, so gradually as that works its way through and clears towards the east, it brings slightly cooler air in behind it. So the nighttime temperature, still quite a bit of cloud remaining, a minimum of 10 Celsius. And then tomorrow, it will be a cooler day. The wind is going to strengthen a bit more, so quite blustery too. A bit of sunshine out there tomorrow, but also a scattering of showers. Not too many, but they will be working their way through gradually through the daytime. 17 Celsius, the maximum temperature. And then something to look forward to if you still want a little bit of warmth. It is October now, but we're faring quite well towards the end of the week. It's not looking too bad at all, is it? The weekend's looking very warm. Well, that's all for now. Anne and the team will be back later this evening at 6.30. Have a lovely afternoon.